Leon, didn't look like the easiest of qualifying sessions out there. Um, yeah, I felt pretty confident until uh, we really tried to push, and when we pushed, we come across a few other issues. Um, you know, I didn't actually set my lap time, I think, until lap six or something on, on that tyre. So when the grip dropped away, the bike seemed to handle more normally again. So, uh, yeah, disappointed. You know, we managed the 25 last year and this year, you know, I really didn't expect to be on the front row for how bad I felt out there. So to be on the front row, um, we've worked good this weekend and we've just got to give it all we've got tomorrow now. Congratulations on another front row, front row anyway. Thank you very much. Cheers. Let's bring in uh, the man who'll start on the middle of the front row tomorrow. Continuing a fine rake of form for Smith BMW, Peter Hickman and Hickey Leon's there saying that the uh, the conditions weren't weren't the best, but uh, you've got to be pleased with a front row start for tomorrow. Yeah, really, really happy. Myself and the Smith BMW team done an awesome job, and uh, yeah, it's a bit windy this afternoon. It's been <laughs> real blustery up the top, and in a few places it's pushing you wide, and you tuck the front, and in other places you can break probably 10 metres later than what you should be able to because the wind's holding you back. So. It's really, really hard to judge when it's like that, but uh, we've done a, the first part of the job's done. You know, we're on the front row and it's always really hard to get away here. So qualifying is a real key part to the race. We've done the first bit, now we're ready for the races tomorrow. Good luck tomorrow. Thanks a lot, cheers. So Shaky, got to ask you about Q2. I mean, talk about leaving it to the last minute, but I'm sure that wasn't the plan. Do you know what, Paul? People, uh, people have already started joking with me that I just seem like I'm uh, a bit whingy and a bit moany this weekend, but uh, honestly, we're, we're really, really struggling. The problem is we're struggling, but we're fastest, and you know we've been fastest for quite a few sessions. So when I say, oh, the bike's not right, everyone just thinks you're just moaning. But honestly, I feel even, even in the qualifying sessions there, we changed the steering head pipe, like it changes the angle of the steering. It's such a big, big change, but we started Q1 with it and had to change back for Q2. And um, I just, Nothing we do at the moment seems to give me the, the confidence I feel I need to, to be able to push as hard as I want to. And Cabwell Park's not the most forgiving of track, so when you feel like you're a passenger on a bike around here, you really feel like you're a passenger. And uh, yeah, it's been a little bit tricky, but we're on pole. That's the first part of the job done. Now we need to come up with something much, much better for, for warm up and then see how the two races go. Wish you well for tomorrow, Shaky. Thank you, Paul.